At 722, let's talk big business headlines. Renovations are changing the face of an Indiana city. There's also a major move coming for a supplier for family attractions. Gary Dick is, of course, of course the host of Inside Indiana Business. It, boy, a lot of shiny stuff in Terre Haute all of a sudden. Yeah, and it's a nice change-up, if you will, for Terre Haute. You know, they've had some economic challenges uh, over the years. But if you look at what's been happening in Terre Haute along Wabash Avenue in downtown Terre Haute, a lot of development. This weekend, a big milestone, a new convention center, a $25 million convention center, will officially open. They've been looking forward to this for a number of years as construction uh, has uh, unfolded. But it's not just the convention center. There have been a couple of new hotels downtown. Uh, Holman Center there has undergone a major renovation. And there's a big casino uh, on the way. It's been reported on a lot. So there's a, a lot of optimism, kind of, kind of a little bit of momentum. They think they can get a million and a half new people mm coming in there every year to see some of these attractions. Wow, fantastic. What is the supplier of fun that's moving closer to the airport? Okay, this is an interesting company I had not heard of. Creative Works in Mooresville. They say they provide wow experiences. And that's everything from uh, from laser tag to, to putt-putt golf to all kinds of uh, interactive experiences uh, that they provide to uh, casinos, cruise ships, resort hotels all over the country. They are actually uh, moving to Indianapolis from Mooresville are expanding. Seven million dollar investment. They're going to add, I think, more than 100 jobs. Uh, we're going to go inside that company this weekend because it is a fascinating company that I don't think a lot of people know about. No, but we will learn this weekend. Yep. What else do you have on tap? Okay, more on the Terre Haute Casino. We'll talk yep. with Mayor uh, Duke Bennett in Terre Haute. We will also talk uh, about uh, the Help Wanted sa sign out, especially for skilled laborers. Uh, Tippecanoe uh, County Building Trades uh, doing some innovative things. Rolls Royce investing 400 million dollars big impact in Indianapolis and also West Lafayette. And in terms of our partners at the Indianapolis Business Journal, we'll be looking at that big $37 million uh, expansion on at uh, 146th and Allisonville Road up in the Fishers area. Uh, reaction to, to that USA Swimming Olympic trials return to Indy. And Purdue and INDOT uh, addressing the problem of uh, running uh, 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 lights at intersections, those types of things. Mm -hmm. More on that as well. Okay. I don't want to wish life away, but I'm really looking forward to the swimming trials. That's going to be it's fun. going to be neat. And nine days, uh, day and night. So that's a long, that's a big event. Absolutely. Awesome. Gary, Gary thank Dick. You. Yeah, we always appreciate it.